Let's talk about Joe Chill in my DC Cinematic Universe. Joe Chill is the most influential person in Batman's life. In a twisted way, Joe Chill is the father of Batman. Joe Chill started off as a feisty up-and-comer working for Carmine Falcone. One day, Carmine would select him for a very important job. You see, Thomas Wayne was planning to donate a lot of money to start drug rehab centers and donate money to the DEA to try and crack down on the drug trade within Gotham City, and that was Carmine Falcone's entire fucking bag. Carmine warned Thomas not to do this, but Thomas refused. And so Carmine selected one of his lower rung guys to take care of it. Now Joe's exact orders were to kill Thomas in front of Martha and Bruce and insist to them that they not try and do what Thomas had done. And so Joe confronted the Waynes that night, but what Joe wasn't expecting was Martha Wayne lunged at him. She went in to attack him for daring to point a gun anywhere near her son. And so Joe, just by reaction, fired. And down went Martha. After realizing what he did, he finished off Thomas Wayne and he ran off into the night. He returned to Carmine and confessed his fuck up. And Carmine made this guy pay. But... Not by killing him or anything like that. You see, one of Carmine's sons was facing a pretty lengthy stint in Blackgate at the time. And so Carmine offered Joe this deal. If Joe took the fall for that and Joe served the time, then he wouldn't kill Joe. And Joe leapt at that opportunity. He copped to the crime and he did the time. And after his time was up, Joe would get out of prison and he'd rejoin the Falcone crime family and specifically become an arms dealer. Eventually, Joe Chill would become an arms dealer full time and he'd break off from the Falcone crime family just about the time when Joker wiped most of them out. So this dude just flew right under Joker's radar. And post Joker, this dude's empire flourished. But then, thanks to the deathbed confession of Carmine Falcone to Batman, Bruce finally learned the name of his parents' killer and he would hunt him down. And to end things off for you guys, I actually have a casting decision for this one. In my DC Cinematic Universe, I would want Joe Chill to be played by Matt LeBlanc. That's right, motherfuckers, Joey from Friends. He's a genuinely good dramatic actor. If you ever get the chance to watch him in any dramatic roles, he has the white hair. He just has a good look about him. And I'm a lot primarily... I want to give the internet the ammunition to make memes that Joey Tribbiani was the one that killed the Waynes. And so in honor of this, I made one.